Do I get the Oscar? <laughs> I'll give you something else. <laughs> can't keep me here. Don't do this. Don't do this. Please, not again, not again! Sarah is only 17 years old. We've never tried this on anyone so young. With the personality disorders, she is manifesting. Couple that with her depressive orders, she's ideal for our new treatment. Yes, but surely her parents... She is a ward of the state. She has no parents. We should be trying other therapies. Miss Tudor. You don't understand what's going on. Yes, but electroconvulsive shock therapy. You won't get away with this. Stop! Please don't. Yes, doctor. No, 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 no. please. I haven't done anything. Please, no. No, 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 no.
drücken. You'll never leave this place. Well, you guys managed to find the cheapest car rental place. It has a few dents, but it works. So, we hit the beach until 4, meet the estate agent at 6 for the keys to the apartment, National Museum tomorrow, then the ghost tour. Now you're talking my language. You have the whole itinerary memorized, Belle? Doing a doctorate at Harvard? What do you think, Michael? And thank God someone knows what's going on. Can you repeat all that? Otherwise, I'll forget. They drive on the wrong side of the road. Just a different side. Probably best I do to drive in. The weather normally change so quick here? Welcome to sunny Sydney. There's some good restaurants down there. Oh, and the laundromat is just around the corner. Oh, and your brother, he wanted me to ask you. Um, don't ruin his apartment. But he knows me. I think that could be the problem. been here a day. You go get ready for tonight. I'll clean it up. Bell's gonna be picking us up in a few hours. Here at Ravenswood Psychiatric Hospital, we are at the forefront of psychiatric care. And this patient presents schizoid symptoms and we will be administering electroconvulsive shock therapy, commonly known as ECT. Using a conductive gel and electro paddles, we will apply a short burst of electricity to the frontal lobes of the patient. What you watching? Don't scare me like that, Carl. Well, this room sums up why you got into all the ghost stuff. My brother loved it. And I used to go with him on ghost tours when he lived with us in LA. Hm. Boyfriend's choice. My choice? Not going on the ghost tour. Carl, 
I've been looking forward to this all week. You know it's all fake, right? <sighs> what? Look, we're in a different country. I just want to spend time with my girlfriend not trudging around a moldy old house. How about this? Be nice tonight, and when we get home, the next two date nights are your choice. Okay? Okay. Okay. The red works. We talked about this. And I have to get ready. Carl. <sighs> Sorry. It's just sometimes it's, it's hard. <laughs> I noticed. I have to get ready. Okay. Well, I'll be in the living room, cleaning up. You'll make the perfect husband. Don't spend all night getting ready. Hey, I wasn't expecting you to call. It's the guy from the bar. He wants to hang out and grab a drink. Uh, no, I can't tonight. Um, I'm hanging with my girl. She does it, but she always looks amazing. Not nearly as amazing as you. Would you love me more if I dressed like her? Babe, don't be ridiculous. Of course I would. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you had a crush on her. Yeah, but then I met you and I found true love. And don't forget, you introduced her to your brother who is much better looking than me. So <laughs> thanks a lot for that. <laughs> This is so exciting. Hey, man. What's going now, on? Now, do you think we'll see one of those spirit globules? Orbs, Val. They're called spirit orbs. Ravenswood is supposedly one of the most haunted places in Sydney. So we might get lucky. Mm. <laughs> Still not a believer. Uh, nope. You? Maybe. I'm just here for the company. Hey, Michael. I, uh, I really appreciate you coming down here, man. And, uh, one more thing. Yeah? Shotgun! <laughs> Classy. <laughs> yeah. Cat and Ben are together? Bullshit. Who to pick that? Says who? Says Facebook. I thought he wasn't interested in her. Lucky guy. She's not backwards and coming forwards. struggling with the damn door. No. Problem, babe? Just call me babe. Hmm. Anyways, I just finished rigging the ECT table, so that's good to go. All we need is for you to do the smash window scan, we're good. Yep. Uh, we've only got the four Americans on the tour tonight, so they should be rocking up any time. Now. It's funny. Mm -hmm. It's really good. Well, this place is in the middle of fucking nowhere. Forgot to charge it, didn't you? No! You can't tell us, we won't judge. I will. Already have. Ha. It's okay, Sophia. He's my older brother. He's meant to judge. But seriously, it was fully charged. Electronics don't work so well around here. It was working fine earlier. Just relax. We will fix it later. <laughs> OK. 
could be the mystic energy here. Ghost and electronics don't mix. I'm up here. You're all down there too. Hey man, you got one choice. You can show us around the shit hole or we'll take the money elsewhere to Kentucky Fuck Chicken, which will be better than the shit you're shoveling anyway. Carl, you promise. Zach, put your testosterone away before you poison yourself. Hi, I'm Emma, and this is my overly manly associate, Zach. And I wouldn't call this place a shithole. The toilets still are, but the ghosts get pretty protective of their home. Welcome to Ravenswood. The most haunted place in all of Australia. Now, the history here is amazing. It goes back 130 years. Oh, 130 years. Carl. This building housed some of society's more insane residents. Some never left here, even after death. But first. All electronics go in here. No phones allowed. Seriously? We want you to enjoy the experience, not be chatting on Facebook and posting pictures you just took. But I'll forget things. Rules are rules. It's okay, I'll remember for you. Excellent. Now, the head doctor here liked to test his newest medical procedures on patients that no one cared about, no one would miss. He borrowed heavily from Nazi research, so they say. Sometimes the ghosts lock us out. They say the doctor killed half a dozen patients before electrocuting himself with his own ECT machine. I already hanged himself. Ah, uh, no, no, no. They don't want people knowing the truth. Every now and again, you can still hear the crackle of electricity in the air around the ECT room. Are we going into the ECT room? Not straight away. Now, for the patients that they subjected to ECT, this room here is where they brought... What's wrong? Spiritual shiver. <gasps> Spiritual shiver. <laughs> Do you want to give it a try? <laughs> wow. Belle, come no, and feel this. No, no, no. Come on. Go feel it, no. Belle. Oh, God. Shit. <laughs> no, that's, that's really cold. Cold as I've ever felt. Oh, my God. Have you got an EVP sensor we could use? Wow, you are really cold. Yeah, so weird. This was the recreation room, or so they called it. This is where they wheeled in patients whose minds were still in flux from the ECT sessions. Now, some very specific cold areas around here. Really? You think we're idiots? <laughs> it's a doorway. It's a draft. Watch. Ooh. See? No ghosts. No chills. Nothing. What's happening? <laughs> oh, come on, guys. There's nothing in here. Damn it, Carl, please. <laughs> Sorry, Zach. Sorry, Zach. So, tell us about the chills. Tell us, Mr. Ghost Man. Ghosts and spiritual entities are not always corporeal. Corporeal? That's a big word coming from you, Legolas. Sometimes it's just as subtle as a change in the air, like a chill. Or a draft. Might be a draft. Probably considering there's windows back there, it's a draft. Let's have a look over here. Maybe you'll hear the murmurs of long dead patients. Dead patients? Ooh. <laughs> so stupid. Out the food they served was up to much. PSB 11. That's a nice toy. Detects electromagnetic frequencies. Sometimes you can just. Emma, have you got anything? Emma? Uh, 
Oh, would you look at that? The lights work. Why use torches? <gasps> Sorry, Zach. He's just... <laughs> He's a good guy. Just sometimes his math runs away from him long before his brain remembers it's meant to think. Really? He has a brain? Hmm. Just thought he was a dick. <laughs> well, maybe he only has enough blood for one of his heads. We both know which one he follows. Come on. I'm pretty sure Anna's going on to one of the other rooms. Can I stay in here a while? <laughs> yeah, that's fine. If you guys want to follow me, just a bit further down the hall, we've got another pronounced cold spot. Shiver my ass. On the day the doctor died, he was treating a teenage girl. His definition of the Hippocratic Oath was do as much harm as possible in the name of science. So he was a Mengele type doctor? In a way, yes. His last victim, Sarah, has never left the building. And after the doctor killed her, he killed himself. And he's never left the building. This is Sarah's room. I guess she doesn't want us to have lights tonight. The last girl was a fighter, so the other patients said. Sometimes you can still hear. I guess tonight she's afraid. Should we be? Maybe I'm possessed. <laughs> okay. EMF activity's increased. Interesting. Do we follow? Only if I let you go. <laughs> so, uh... You can hear the crying as well. You hear her too? Really? Yeah. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> you know, it's, it's kind of sexy seeing you happy. Seeing you smile. Carl. Sophia, I love you. Hey, Carl. You make me mad. Stop. Sophia, if you love me. I do. Damn it, Sophia! <sighs> I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. You know why. We'll get there. Only six more months to wait. I don't want to wait any longer. We've been together for two years. We're here. Having fun, doing what you want to do. You've come this far. Why the sudden pressure now? You know what? I am here to have fun. But not how you clearly hoped. Go cool off. I'm going to see what's got Zach so interested. Yeah, that's right. Go see what Zach wants. A crying track? That threw me. There was sound. I couldn't get the switch to work in here. You sure? No, I'm an idiot. Of course I'm sure. Because the cold spot in the rec room, we don't normally put the dry ice there. It wasn't me. Okay, well, next time let me know. I might not be so good at improvising. Uh, whatever. 
These switches are getting old. We need to replace the lot. Spend money to make money, you know? Mm-hmm. It's not a bad group tonight. I checked the switch under the table earlier. I hit it. Lights go out. We're ready for the big one. The big one. In this room, the doctor killed his last patient. She nearly escaped, but they captured her, strapped her down, and electrocuted her to death. Sometimes you can hear Sarah's ghost screaming as the doctor tortures her. Where's Carl? Ah, uh, yeah, no, I'm sure he's fine. Jesus. You want to give it a go? It's all part of the experience. She won't actually electrocute you. Come on. You'll have fun being the crazy girl. You don't have to. Yeah. I'll do it. You sure? I'll be fine. I'm okay. Come on then. Up on the table. First, they would strap their victim down. Starting with the ankles, of course. Then, they'd move up to the wrists. You okay? <laughs> Finally, they'd strap down the head. Gag the mouth so you don't bite your tongue. They'd turn the dial. High. Then wait a moment. And then... Fuck's sake, really? No, oh, you let me go. Get me out of here. The keys are on the ACT machine. Where are they? It's okay, it's okay, we're here. Oh God, oh God. Over there, by the door. Come on! How the hell did they get there? Oh my God, who gives a shit? Get me out of here. Shine it over here. Some light here would be good. Hey! Okay, we're almost there, we're almost there. Okay, oh my God, okay. okay. Sophia! I'll go find her and check the fuses. You guys just What the hell do you think you're doing, man? Easy, man. I've got to go don't find- Don't turn off the lights when I'm on the fucking can! I don't give a shit. I've got to go find Sophia! Where's Sophia? What happened? Sophia! Sophia! Sophia, I know you're scared right now, but we need to get out of here. Sophia! There you are. What are you doing in Sarah's room? I don't know. It's okay. I need to get the lights back on, so I'm going to check the fuse box. It's this way. I heard you crying. It wasn't me. It wasn't one of our usual tricks either. How could this usually moan? I think Emma might have changed something and, you know, didn't tell me.
Okay? You got a good scare out of all of us. I should have been here for Sophia. But now, it's time to turn the lights back on. You saw me try the light switch, it didn't do anything. Oh, well, so ghosts use light switches now. Ghosts are considered to be electrical energy. They don't have to use the light switch if they don't want. That is not normally unlocked. Ah! Ah! Yes! <laughs> Asshole! You look like you needed a laugh. Things were getting pretty tense back there. I hope Sophia's okay. You know what I'm saying. I'm more worried about you. Are you okay? Yes. Just for a moment, I felt something. Something dark. Angry. A lot of patients died there. The doctor... No, I felt it in me. Not towards me. Does that make sense? There's no darkness in you. Just for a moment, I, I wanted to hurt everyone. I hurt you. The moment's passed. Once they get the lights back on, we'll get out of here. Little bit of light to work by helps. Were you a boy scout or something? Yeah, they threw me out for lighting too many candles. I'll just check the fuse box. Uh, okay. Why? It's just an old fuse box. Well, yeah, maybe, but the fuses aren't old. And they're perfectly fine. Hey, Carl. How long have you and the Goth Princess been together for? A year or so. Relax. Pull up a chair. Not that one. Check out the back legs. If the power was on, I'd have said to have a seat, and bang, the chair gets pulled backwards. Hmm. So everything here is faked. The place is haunted, but not much. You just help the ghosts out. I'll show you a few other rooms and tricks. Carl, through Bell. So, you and what's the name are engaged? Yeah, about four months now. Although sometimes you wouldn't think so. Hmm. Good. Yeah, she's, she's been through a lot, you know. I do care about her. Mm hmm. I don't. I swore to myself I wouldn't do this ever again. Oh, you need to learn to swear better. Must be oh, hard. Mm. He doesn't really seem your type. He. He is who he is. Give me a moment. Hi. Where are you going? Exploring. I want to find the source of the crying. Sophia. What? What happened back there? The lights went out, didn't you notice? No, I mean with you. You're happy to go off and explore the dark, but the ECT table? Drop it. Sophia, most people don't understand how dangerous ghosts can be if you're vulnerable. <laughs> I don't want to risk- You think I'm vulnerable? You don't even know me. I'm doing my job. Keeping people safe. So what's going on? Okay. You want to know? I have to. Fine. One afternoon, walking home from school, a stranger who they never caught dragged me off the street and raped me. 
I was so terrified I couldn't, I couldn't move, I couldn't, I couldn't fight back. He completely destroyed me. I got horribly depressed and drugs didn't work. I couldn't even kill myself. Nothing had worked, so they tried ECT. I, I didn't think they still did that. They did it to 100,000 people last year. I was just a statistic. I had no idea. They strapped me down, drugged me, and electrocuted me. It worked as far as they were concerned. I didn't try and kill myself again. But my memory isn't what it was. And I still have nightmares. I am so sorry. Happy now? Job done? Am I vulnerable? Weak? Safe? Sophia, I... What was that? Sounds like door slamming. Okay, I think we should wait by the car. Oh. Shit, open! Let's go find the others. What the hell was that? Just in case, we better go check. The doors won't open. We can't get out. I'm officially free. We can get out through the front door. No, we tried it. Okay, we can get out this way. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Now's not the time, Carl. What the hell is going on? The tour isn't over yet, is this it? This isn't us. Bullshit. Okay, good work. The loony bin has locking doors, but you are not fooling anyone. When we make doors slam, we do it manually. Why do you think there's two of us? <laughs> One runs the show, the other makes them scarce. Something else closed those doors. This is real. I don't believe you. It doesn't matter, because we're trapped. Hey. What the hell? This should be entertaining. Come on.
Are you insane? Believe it now? Fuck yes. Who should be going in there? We need to contact the ghosts. No, why? Because they're the ones keeping us here. Do you want to explain? Belle. You fucking promised never again. Look in the mirror, sis. You never told her. I trusted you. Guys, now is not the time. Are you sure about this? You swear this is real. Those doors didn't close themselves. Hope the spirits are feeling generous because I want out. According to this website, these symbols create a portal for spirits to come and go from this plane into theirs. I don't find any happy ghosts in here. Michael and Belle hold hands and place the other one in the hand symbol. Whatever happens, don't let go. These symbols are connecting us, and if we break the circle, the spirits won't leave. Carl, give me your hand. Are you really fucking sure about this? Yes. Spiritus Priorita? Spiritus Vovunt Hoc Loco? Pasamas et nobuscum. Locumini ad nos. Pasamas ad dementio nobis. Dimitas locumistum. No! No! They can't! I stopped him! I let him loose! You? What? What? Spirit of the past, spirits that live in this place, we beseech you. Come and be one with us. Talk with us. We beseech you. Let us leave. If they set him free, we're all dead. I don't understand. I had to. I had to to stop him. Spiritus Priorita. Spiritus Vuvunt Hoc Loco. Quasimus et Nobis Gum. Dementio Nobis Dementio Locum Ibus. To escape him, I had to kill my boyfriend. Just before he died, his eyes, they changed back. The doctor was gone. Spirit of the past, we beseech you. Let us leave this place. Let us be. You have to stop them. If they give him a body, he'll... <laughs> She's gone. <laughs> Let us leave. Possumus <laughs> 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 
Agmistus Locum Istum. Is it over? <laughs> She's in you, isn't she? And he's coming for you. What do I do? Hide. Pray if you believe. Pray harder if you don't. Is it over? I hope so. Let's go. Hey, you okay? Come on. What's his problem? I don't know. Emma? What does it mean if his hand slipped from the marks you drew? Fucked if I know. Here, come on. Oh my god. Shit, man. That is cool. It doesn't feel cool. What do we do? I don't know. <laughs> Zach Wood, he believes in this shit. I don't. Now I do. Oh, crap, oh let's god. go. Michael, Bell. are you okay? No. Bell. Bell, get out. Stop it, Michael. This is Ravenswood. I can't find Sophia, and if the doctor finds her first, he will kill her. We can't leave them in there. You know what could happen. No. <laughs> please, please, she's your fiance. My boyfriend, so just do it for me too. Shit, Bell! Remember what you did to that bully in school who had it in for me? We can't deal with this level of possession. We need to get help. By then it'll be too late. We go in now or she dies. <laughs> Let her go. I won't. Yes, you will. No. Move. No. <laughs> Michael, you don't want to do this. He doesn't. But I do. Run. No. I've been running from you for 65 years. It ends now. You're right. No more running. Get 
you help her? Help her? I'll check the front door. Emma, you check the side door. Don't leave me. It's locked. In there. It's locked. So is the front door. Ugh. Oh. I've got an idea. Guys, please just trust me on this. Sophia, I need you to stay here, okay? Guys, come with me, now, now! I control this building. You're not leaving in that girl. Don't underestimate me. This time, I have something I've never had before. What's that? Friends. What was that? It's a binding spell. It'll buy us some time. Jesus, he's strong. Emma, get the rope from the smash window scare. What are you gonna rock climbing or something? Yeah, I'm gonna go rock climbing at midnight, genius. It's a binding spell. He's stuck in the room, but he can still open the door. What about Michael? Will they sort him off? Yeah. All we need to do is just hold off Michael long enough so that we can get the ghost out of Sophia. What? The ghost needs a physical body to leave in. That's why the doctor has locked us in. Oh shit, man. You know, like that. Okay, no, we have to help Michael. No, no, no. no. <laughs> He will die unless we get her out of Sophia. No. If you if you pull me out, the doctor, he'll keep torturing me, please. No. Don't make him come out, please. Sophia, please listen to me, okay? You have a ghost of a patient inside of you. I am the patient. My name is Sarah. No, Sarah died 65 years ago. No. Sophia, please, you are stronger than this. I know you can do it. You're strong. No, she isn't. I'll kill her. Then you're stuck here. I've been stuck here for 65 years. I'll find someone else. But you'd risk her life. I know how she feels about you. What the hell are you doing to my girl? She can't breathe, man. Answer me. But shut up and help her. You're safe. It's okay. Just please, you can fight this. <laughs> Sophia, please, listen to me, okay? Please, Sophia. Okay, Sarah. Sarah, I promise we won't hurt you. What? Shut up! What gives you the right to tell me to shut up? She's dying! I promise, Sarah, we're not going to hurt you. We won't let the doctor near you. I promise. You are safe. Okay? You're safe. <laughs> Bill, take her to the recreation room. <laughs> This is not over. Yeah, it is. You didn't answer my question. What are you doing with her? Nothing, all right? What the hell? We'll never survive if we don't work together. You touch her and I'll kill you. You know what? You really don't deserve her. Oh, what? And you do? Hell of a lot more than you do. What's so special about this girl? You're not half the girl she is. Belle, I need your help. Come with me. No, I'm not leaving her. It's about helping her. And Michael. How? Look, what can I do? We need light. Okay. The ghosts are electrical energy, so they're going to drain our torches. We have enough batteries to last, but rather than take the risk, I'd like to use candles. We need to be able to see what we're doing if we're going to help her. 
and to help Michael. Come on, give her a hand, help her out. Screw that, I'm staying here. I'm not leaving you alone with my fiance. Nice try. It's it's fine. It's probably better I go by myself. Okay. Okay, we're gonna be right around the corner. So if you need any help, just yell out. Okay. Well, um, light some by the door. Help me, Bell. He's not in me anymore, Bell. You know me. I would never lie to you. Sophia? Can I talk to Sophia? Sarah? Can I please speak to Sophia? I'm happy to help you, but only if I can speak to her. Come on, Sarah, that's fair, give and take. What do you want from her? She's my friend. You hurt her? Made her tell you what happened to her? I feel her pain. It happened to me too. I felt her coming to my world. Her pain called to me, drew me out. The doctor too. What do you want from her? I want to make sure she's okay. She's fine. I want to hear it from her. Otherwise, we're not going to help you. I'll kill her. No, you won't. She's not like anyone else you've possessed, is she? Because there's the link. There's a shared pain of the ECT. Sophia? Oh, God. Sophia, Sophia, <laughs> Sophia, sweetie, I'm here. It's going to be okay. It's okay. We will get her out of you, I promise. She's not going to let you. She needs a body to walk out of here. Otherwise, the doctor will just keep torturing her. What do we have to do to protect you? Kill him. Kill Michael. Bell, I love you. Help me, Bell. Help me before they kill me. They're going to kill me. I'm not going to kill my little sister's boyfriend. There must be another way. There isn't. Please, you have to kill him to protect me. I'm scared. The doctor, he... He tortured me. Michael is not the doctor. He killed half a dozen patients. He electrocuted them to death. The doctor did, not Michael. They are the same thing now. And he wants me dead. I don't want to die, Come. Oh, for fuck's sake, get me a bucket. It's not the first time he's cheated on you, is it? She came on to me. <laughs> you bastard! Sophia! What? You just couldn't wait, did you? I fucked up! You promised me! You swore to me! I will make this right. Get us out of here, then get her out of me. Do you remember... That first night we spent together. I was just as nervous as you were. But we fit it, you and me. Yeah, we did. It was just you and me, baby. Like it is now. 
The doctor's gone. I won't let them hurt you. He's coming. I can feel it. I can't kill the doctor without killing Michael. Sister! to do this, but we need to find Michael before he finds us. What are you going to do to him? Look what he's done. To you? To Carl? We have to stop him. No, but he's Michael. He's not. Would Michael hurt you? No, that's the doctor. They're not the same. We have to kill him. That's not you speaking. There's no way the Sophia I know would say that. You're right. Sophia is weak. Cowardly. She couldn't fight the man who attacked her. And her shame nearly killed her. She's stronger with me and her. She likes me and her. You know nothing about it. Don't I? We have to find your sweet, loving, psychopathic boyfriend and kill him before he kills us. Oh, it's not us he wants. It's Sarah he wants. So I say we give him what he wants. <laughs> Try it, and I'll kill your best friend. Your choice. Fine. But we have to try and get the doctor out of him. The doctor won't let him go. Can you handle hurting him? Look, let's just split up. You and me will check the rooms off this side of the hall, Sophia and Emma the other side. I'm not going with her. Look, I I'm sorry about what happened, but I think this is a little bit bigger than that. Sophia, Belle's injured, all right? I should be with her. I'm bigger than Emma and you put together. Fine. Come on. We have to find him before Sophia does. Sarah's in control of her. Yeah, and if she finds Michael first, she'll kill him. Probably Emma too. Are you okay, Belle? Like, really? Yeah, yeah, just scared. I'm okay. We'll get out of this. We just need to get that ghost out of Sophia. Yeah, but how? If we try to force her out of Sophia, Sarah will kill her before she's left her body. Oh, Sarah's unpredictable. She's dangerous. She's scared. 65 years of torture will do that to you. Maybe. Let's check out in here. Maybe there's a way out. Can we get through this one quick? You went through hell in here. So many people died here. We'll get out of here, I know. You're not alone anymore. We'll just have to give the doctor what he wants. She's your best friend. But the doctor is killing people. Do we have a choice anymore? Can you leave her to be tortured?
What did you do? What did you do? You killed my friend! Don't lie! Hey! Hey! I, I didn't! Bullshit! It was Michael! What? I was upset. This room gets to me and, and Emma gave me a hug and then she turned around and then suddenly her head got pulled back and his, his throat, there was, there was blood everywhere. And Michael holding a knife. He ran out. Side door. You check that room. I'm going to check the star rooms off the main hall. Do we trust her? She looks pretty freaked. Yeah. If you didn't care about her, what would you think? Oh, I know the look. If I didn't care about her, I'd say that Sarah and Sophia have both been through hell. ECT, torture at the hands of sadists. Carl's dead, Michael's trying to kill her. I honestly think she's that scattered that she can't get a straight thought together in her head, let alone kill someone. She's unstable. She can't control whether she's being Sophia and when she's being Sarah. There's something we can do. Do you trust me? I don't even know you. Sophia does? Not really. Okay, fine. Don't trust me, but listen to me. Unless you tell me you're going to kill the doctor, you've got nothing to say that I want to hear. Good. So what do we need to do? How do we get the doctor out of Michael's body? The eyes are the windows to the soul. That's how we jump from body to body. Only the most powerful ghosts can move freely. Okay, so we cover his eyes, then he's trapped, then we can kill him. It has to be something significant to him. Will this work? It can't be. Are there letters on it? <laughs> his initials. He used to gag us with his own handkerchief before electrocuting us. That'll work. So what's the trap? You are. What? The doctor wants you, so we lure him in here. Why here? This room is the spiritual energy center for the entire place. We trap the doctor here. You kill him, we walk free. And then... You leave Sophia's body. That's our condition. Okay. Then what's the plan? No. You can't make me, please. No. I promise we won't hurt you. There has to be another way. There isn't. We need the doctor to believe we're on his side. We strap you down and go hide just around the corner come to get you, we'll get him. I can't. I won't. Well, you have to- <laughs> Please! No, stop, stop, Jesus, Jesus, back off. Back off, all right? I got this. <laughs> Sophia, please, if there was any other way, we would do it. They strapped me down, hurt me. 
get the chance to beat them. I'm going to be right next to you the entire time. Please just trust me. We are running out of time. Sophia, please just trust me. tight enough so you can still slip out of them, okay? I'll be right next to you the whole time. You're doing the right thing. He'll probably die, which is regrettable. I told him the truth about me, but he didn't agree. I had no choice. You killed your own boyfriend. No, I didn't. Belle. I killed Belle's boyfriend. When she opened the door, I saw my chance to get to you. Belle has the same color eyes as me, so none of you realized I was in her. You know, I didn't want to kill him, but you know, he got in the way, like Nicole. You know, all they had to do was let me finish what I started 65 years ago. No, please don't. I'm not Sarah. She's not in me anymore. Why are you doing this to me? She's in you, whether she's controlling you or not. She's trapped. Why are you doing this to me? I didn't do anything wrong. Maybe not, but Sarah did. <laughs> they convicted me of murdering six patients, but I didn't. It's a game, sweetie. <laughs> she did. No one would believe a 17-year-old girl could be a psychopath. I needed to protect my hospital, so I hid the deaths and waited for my chance. You don't understand what's going on here. I had to kill her before she killed anyone else. No, I'm not her. But she possessed me. They say I killed myself, but I didn't. <laughs> oh. 
all these years, I haven't been torturing her. I've been fighting her, stopping her from escaping. If she walks out the door in you, she will kill again. No, please don't. I'm sorry, Sophia. It'll all be over soon. <laughs> I couldn't hurt anyone, please. <laughs> it's fine. The power is back on now that I need it. Oh God, no, please don't do it, please. <laughs> She's gone. Free. <laughs> you won. You won. <laughs> uh, okay, yeah, I definitely need a hospital. Maybe Sarah's gone, but we can't let her get back into either one of us. Close your eyes. What? Close your eyes. The ghosts come and go through our eyes. If you close them, we'll be fine. I trust you. I trust you. I'm never going into another hospital, ever again. The, the, the lights? The, the wind? <laughs> All for show. I, 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 don't, I, I don't understand. The pathetic little Sophia, dressed all tough, but so very weak, walked into my world. I knew she was the one I'd walk out with. Carl? Emma? They shouldn't have cheated on me. You should have seen the look on Emma's face when I slit her throat. 
I'm free. The doctor failed. I saw you leave Sophia. Did you, did you open her eyes? No. Ghosts are electrical energy. You said so yourself. When the doctor tried to kill me in Sophia, he made me more powerful. I fed off the electricity. Powerful enough to come and go from Sophia when I want. I didn't need her eyes to be open. <laughs> I'm, I'm outside. I'll see you in a moment. <laughs> oh my god, what happened? My boyfriend, he, he, he tried to kill me. It'll be okay, I'll go get some help. <laughs> Don't leave me. Okay. <laughs> I won't. It's going to be okay. I know. Please help me! Help me! Into my eyes, they'll tell you I'm the devil in disguise. Wait, 